Welcome to PJ's Artsy Channel. Before we begin the video, please subscribe and hit the button bell for you to get notified when we have new exciting videos to watch. This is the image that we are going to convert. This is the image before and this is the image after. By the way thanks to Photoshop tutorial simple vector art by information and tutorials. Now let's begin. Let's trace first the whole part of the eyes. Make sure to trace every tiny detail of the eyes. Trace first the outside part of the eyes or the main part of them and then trace next to the inside part details. Now, to trace an image, you should now have three layers or more in the layer window. A, tracing, layers at the top. A locked layer with your image in the middle, and a locked, white background layer at the bottom. If they're not in this order, drag them to arrange them as such. Choose a tool in the tool menu at the left side of the window. You can use the pencil tool. Pen tool creates even untapered strokes that are the same width in the middle as they are at both ends. This tool works well if you're going to trace using several small strokes that meet at the ends. The pencil tool is a pencil-shaped icon near the top of the second section of the tool menu. If you see a paintbrush icon but not a pencil icon, long click on the paintbrush icon, then click on pencil tool. Also the brush tool, creates tapered strokes that are thinner on the ends and thicker in the middle. This tool works well if you want to create a softer, brush stroke appearance with your tracing. The brush tool is a paintbrush shaped icon near the top of the second section of the tool menu. If you see a pencil icon but not a paintbrush icon, long click on the pencil icon, then click on brush tool. And then the pen tool, creates editable paths with anchor points that can be moved or adjusted. The pen tool works well for tracing objects that you'd like to change or alter considerably when you're done tracing. Click on the fountain pen icon below the T in the tool menu to select the pen tool. If you did something you don't like using the pencil strokes, use Ctrl plus Z if you want to undo a recent mistake or press E for the eraser tool and drag across the marks you want to erase. Now we start tracing the lips. Thanks to information and tutorials on this amazing tutorial video. I will let the video continue and please watch until the end. Enjoy watching.
Please subscribe and hit the button bell.